Jean, you work in two male-dominated fields, technology and construction. You graduated with an architecture degree and worked in the industry for years before renovating your own house in 2007. Your mistake of hiring the wrong contractor led you to launch Sweeten, as in Home Sweet Home, a technology platform that connects homeowners with vetted general contractors and stays involved until project completion. Seven years later, Sweeten just passed the $1 billion mark of construction projects in the pipeline. Woo! Woo! So <laughs> Talk to us about that tension between carving out your own path as a founder and what Chris is talking about, being told no and being told you're too young. Can you hear me? Oh yeah, there I am. <laughs> you know, I am, I am in two male dominated industries. So construction, I was an architect by training. I worked in construction for many years. I then tried to uh, start a venture back to business and, and realized, wow, there are just as many um, white guys in construction and technology <laughs> and there are not a lot of women who, w women period, and certainly ones that look like me, there are very, very few. And I just, I wanna say, you know, this hearing the no's, you definitely hear so many no's. And I've actually internalized it a little differently now. I hear it as like, okay, I am one no closer to my yes. Right. Like every time I hear one, I'm like, yes, I'm so much closer now. <laughs> so that is, has definitely been like a mindset shift that's happened. But yeah, when I first started out, it was, it was tough because one, it is so male dominated, and two, most of the men in both of uh, the fields are much older. So in architecture and construction, most of the men are you know, much older. And as the venture partner that was up here speaking before, you know, most of the venture partners are kind of older white men as well. And so when someone like me walked in, they really did not have a lot of pattern recognition, and, and that is changing, which is so exciting. Um, I heard Julia Hart's company uh, Eventbrite mentioned. If you guys didn't watch the Eventbrite opening, it was so fantastic to see Julia up there. Please go and look at it. So the patterns are changing, certainly, but yeah, it was, there was a lot of no's and a lot of like audible, like, what are you doing here? <laughs> in the beginning, which, which is, can be tough. 